Hi friends, this is Ryan and I'm the developer of AutoPad. I want to show you how you can import your own pad sounds in the new version 1.8. We're going to tap on the sounds icon down here in the bottom right. And you notice that a plus icon is displayed up here. And this is a free feature, uh, no in-app purchase required. We're going to hit the plus and we see the form for importing a sound. Let's give our sound a name. I've got a nice bright pad from Rocky Mountain Sounds that I'm going to bring in here. And let's tap, and this pulls up the iCloud uh, Apple Files picker. So anything in iCloud is fair game. Let's go to pad samples and load in this file. MP3, WAV files, it's all good. And if we want to bring in a pad that's not in the key of C, that's totally fine. We just have to change the root note. AutoPad will take it and pitch it to all 12 keys uh, using its internal sampler, and I think it sounds really good. You can import as many pads as you want, though. So let's hit the check mark, and now we see that the sound shows up down here. If we long press, we're going to get the option to rename or delete. We don't want to do that, though. We just want to hear how it sounds. really nice. The other thing we want to say is that due to memory rest restrictions on the device, if we have a large audio file, we're only going to cut a short portion of that and load that into the sampler. So if a file exceeds four minutes, I load three and a half minutes of audio into AutoPad sampler and apply a short crossfade so you don't hear any clicks. The one other thing to point out is that you can import directly from other audio editing apps. If you hit the share button down here, you will see an option to bring your sound into AutoPad using the familiar, um, the familiar interface. So hope you guys like this feature. Really appreciate people using AutoPad and I'm excited to keep working on it and keep making it more useful for you. Uh, let me know how you like the features, and um, have a great day.